Right guys, welcome back. Oh wow, that's a bit, wow. <laughs> um, welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy on the Switch. Um, we are heading outside, as you can see, for the first time. Not the best first impression now, with that pop in and- I was glad Professor Weasley asked <laughs> it wasn't me to good. accompany you. Oh boy. Really? Yes, I have good. to One bit. an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a better be in the village. <laughs> the timing of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. I've not heard good things, basically, oh, um, about the open world. Nice it um, it's not seamless anymore. After being cooped up in and rooms. yeah, the graphics are not Great ideal. Mistake to take see, it as an elective class, believe me. I believe you. Though I suppose you would not really call it elective when your mother was the one who elected that you take it. Water doesn't look too bad. Hogsmeade is beautiful. It's a bit choppy. <laughs> it's a bit, a bit bluntly. Tell you to visit at Christmas. Did that guy but just pop in randomly? Few times of year, I would rather be indoors. <laughs> Not much for the cold, are you? Also, oh, some people want to see I the combat, the so we're going to so try and do some combat in this episode as well. This video. Getting used to. I did not Check out the fast traveling. I oh, that's really bad. If you travel around the open world and also back oh, to Hogwarts. Wait, over here. I often spot lacewing flies in this area. Oh, what's so special about them? They are interesting to look at, but if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. I'm sure I can. Yeah, I mean, again, on like a tiny screen, like the Switch, it, it might be okay. But I'm playing this on like a, a fairly normal Look, size screen. And from it's, the Forbidden Forest. Yeah. Hippogriffs. Oh, there's a lot of popping. I wonder if something startled them. I heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. I can completely see why, by the way. They wanted, they wanted to release a Switch version. Um, I think it's... 100, 130 systems, 130 million systems in the world, the which it's is a lot. <laughs> it's quite a lot. As the name implies. Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Ah, yeah, text just coming really late. Pass that ruin. Those lanterns, look like they're floating. And Hogwarts doesn't have the same kind of like punch. Um, as the uh, as the PS5 version, it's just yeah, it's not quite the quite the same. But I mean, it's sort of what we expected. I think Mortal Kombat was definitely a worse uh, worse pull, I would in my opinion. All of my time exploring, if I could. It's just getting I a bit old now, isn't it? I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, since you're relatively new here. She said that. Hmm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say. Well, I certainly learn a great deal in class. Much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. Yeah, I was fairly complimentary in my first video, but I'm a little bit concerned now. I remember the words <laughs> um, that followed my arrival feeling oh quite strange. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. I'm getting used to things. What about you? Do you finally feel settled? I still miss my homeland, but it is beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts has become something of a home now, I would say. Hopefully it will for you too. I haven't seen any loading yet, so it feels seamless for now. He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Oh, Mr. Moon. Looks like he's worse for wear. He's not in good shape. <laughs> I can promise you that. Hello, Mr. Moon. Hello, have Mr. You Moon, you good? Um, you might want to turn back, Miss on I. Uh, Agree. Turn and let's turn, let's turn back. run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. Moon? Jimmy, guys, Dudley and Arian. Mm, terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Oh, Mr. Moon. Also, the game got no guys. Game of the Year nominations, which is kind of I think he had too much fun upset. in the village. I that I have never seen him in such a state. What was that about? That was a very weird animation. So she was screaming, and then... That running looks so choppy. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, no. Uh, 
Merely there. Oh there well. Much to see outside of the castle walls. The sign's like, hugs me too. Oh no, is it gonna I pop in now? To explore oh, whenever oh. you'd like. Oh. The rumors being what they are about God, goblins and such, it might be nice <laughs> to have a friend with you. I'll keep that in mind, Natty. Thank you. Is it gonna load? Oh, was this? Yeah, this was. This this isn't seamless anymore. How long does it take to load? I should probably do a timer, shouldn't I? I will for the next one. <laughs> I'll be more professional. Um, yeah, I was the first video. I was. I had some concerns. But, yeah, playing it a bit more and actually heading out into the open world. This is a long loading as well, isn't it? Oh, boy. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I guess this is why the Switch is such a great second console for me, um, in my opinion. I'm sure people would disagree. Yeah, it just add, it just adds oh, that loading screen. It just feels so annoying. Like, it takes you out of it a little bit. And here we are. There we go. It is hard to know where to start. The Three Broomsticks is the place for butter beer, and you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need. Professor Weasley oh. said that you need to get potion recipes, yep. spell crafts, some yep. seeds, and... All the basics. A new wand. Of, oh, yes, course. of course. You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Sounds good. Sounds like a plan. Enjoy so yeah, I did want to show you guys some combat. So if we just grab all the necessary items we need. There's the map of Hogsmeade. So where should we go first? We should probably go to the scrolls first. Yeah, I mean, Hogsmeade's probably going to take a bit of a hit as well. It's quite a demanding area again. It was very... So the, the footage they showed before the release, the Switch version, was cutscenes. Um, I actually asked for a review code and they said basically we don't have any, um, which is complete. That's not up to the, that's not the PR's fault. That's someone higher up, I would imagine. Um, so they must have had some concerns. Some concerns, for sure. <laughs> and it, it's the perfect time to release it, um, obviously with Christmas around the corner. Anyway, I'll see you guys in a minute with the combat. Right, so I've got the bits we need at Hogsmeade. Um, we are going to meet Natty at the town square. And I guess you guys might see the first combat, maybe? Revelio. Potentially. In my videos. Let's see how this goes. This is a pretty big fight, actually. This is going to be a, a little test for the Switch, indeed. Let's see what happens. Alright, let's do it. Ah, I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favourite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Oh boy. <laughs> Big fat trolls! That wasn't too bad actually. Consider it. So I'm pretty sure that's a cutscene. This is a lot of what they sh showed off during the trailers. Away from the building. Away from the village. And while obviously it's not the same quality as the PS5 cutscenes or Series X cutscenes, it's not, not bad. It's not bad. Oh boy. Those red ones you have to dodge. Oh, no, that'll screw up. Woo. Where is he? You big fat armor troll. Where is he? Woo. Maybe we can, can we not throw stuff at him. Well, that was an option. Woo. Oh, there we go. 
And again. Was trying to beat him at his own game. I like it. Do more. Like there's more stuff to throw than just barrels. And again. What a flack we're witnessing right now. He's angry. Oof. Looks like it's just barrels. Drink. Finish him off. What do about being here? Yeah. Healing. What is this special magic? It's ancient magic. That was neat. <laughs> that wasn't too bad, actually. It was all right. I was expecting maybe choppy. Goodness, a second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll? I did. By let's yourselves. get let's get past this. I we don't Merlin, to, we don't need to hear this. I've heard this before. Well, I'm glad you uh, were impressed. I need to repair. Don't I mean repair. Repair. Please do. What else can we repair? Rebellion. Accio. Repairer. Those boxes are back in the right place. We'll fix that big fat house as well. Good, isn't it? Well, these repairs don't feel. One less thing for officer Singh maybe to worry as about. ambitious as the console, maybe Rebellion. the big PS5s of the world. Repairer. Oh, I've also got to repair. Uh, over here? Is there to repair here? Repairer. Fixing something. Oh, is it done? Yay! Give me a free, a free robe. You know you want to. Inside a shop. Yeah, again, let me know in the comments what you guys think of this particular build. I do want to find a way to um, work out what the FPS actually is. I don't want to become a digital foundry expert or anything like that, but it'd just be intriguing, honestly. If I am going to Hello, do sir. videos like this, showing off games, Allow me to introduce myself. the FPS is Augustus a big, a big factor. If it's running at 15 or 20, like it, it's a factor. Remarkable bravery <laughs> it's not great. Fighting those trolls. And not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful oh, it's state. It's just what I do. It's all good. Well, give me my free stuff. Thank you. Do it. <laughs> free robe. Can I equip it straight away? Uh, I can purchase it for free. And it's done. Of the gear screen. Again, you have no other way to play the game. Um, select the robe. I still think this is a good option. I still feel well, yeah. I'll be incredibly tempted to buy a PS5. What an extraordinary introduction to. Shall we head? In incredible introduction to Hogsmeade. And the outside world. I sell even more battle-worthy items. Should you be inclined, sure you you're most welcome. Yeah, the extra loading screens, the popping, I think, is particularly bad actually when you're just roaming around the world. Like literally every lamppost was just not loading in. It, the lens was just floating, which I guess, <laughs> being a Harry Potter game, is like okay. Right, so we're now going to do, I'm going to do a little bit of a timer here. How long does it take to get back to Hogwarts? Let's find out. A very professional timer. Um, go to the world map. I'm pretty sure there, was, there wasn't a loading screen. I'm now dying myself when I, when you go to Hogsmeade. I don't, I don't imagine. I, I remember there being like a, a weird barrier where you couldn't fly into it. I think that was it. Maybe that's why I'm getting confused. 
Right, is it gonna begin? Fast travel. Start. Let's see how long this takes. In a world where loading screens can be a couple of seconds. It's already 10 seconds. I don't know what it's stored on. It might be an SD card, I don't know to be honest. 20 seconds of your hard-earned time. You'll be doing this a lot throughout the game. Now, 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Pretty much 30, 32, 33 seconds. Not too bad. Not too shabby. Um, what I'm going to do... Is I'm going to go to the world map. I want to enter... I want to go to the Forbidden Forest. So long mistakes. Uh, reset. Oh, that wasn't a very good timing there, was it? We'll add a couple of seconds on that. How long does it take to go back to the open world? I'm guessing there will be more loading screen areas as well. Um, if Hogsmeade is a loading screen. So 25 seconds, so it's about to, it's about to, it's too bad. Again, about 30 seconds again, roughly. Which ain't bad. Got some outpost. Oh, thank you very much. Did want to test uh, Fosh Travel just quickly between open world to open world. I've heard that's particularly bad. Um, also a chance to, again, look at the open world in all its glory. Yeah, some text there was a lot. That is a lot of popping. Is it up here? It's up there, isn't it? Are we going the right way? I hope so. <laughs> we are going the right way, okay. Let's go. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting, I'm, I've said this before, I'm really guided. One, there was no nominations for this game at all. Uh, in terms of the, the Game Awards. And I've... I'm sort of guessing we all know why that probably is. Um, but still. For me, it's probably my personal game of the year. Um, oh, we could actually fast travel from here. I don't think this counts as Hogwarts. How nice to see you, my young so I don't, you don't have to load back. Obviously, if you go through the door. Oh, man, I'm trying to remember now. If I played... Yeah, I guess there's gonna, there'll be a big loading screen if I enter a Hogwarts again, but I don't remember there being one on the PS5. Is that right? I think that's right. I believe that is right. Where's the purple dotted lines? Anyway. Uh, if we now... Do, 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 go back to the world map. She's still in Hogwarts. And let's fast travel to here, the Forbidden Forest. Don't know how it ended up going the wrong way, but there we go. How long does this take? It's nothing particularly crazy. I've, I have, we have seen some absolutely atrocious loading screens. Remember the old GTA 5 online loading screens, which took like a minute to two minutes? <laughs> it's just, it just mad. Absolutely mad. So this is taking... Is it going to load now? I think it's about to load. So yeah, about five seconds again. Okay. Fair enough, not too bad. But again, the new loading screens not being a seamless open world anymore. There's a lot of pop in. Yeah, not ideal. But there we go. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know if you guys are picking up Hogwarts Legacy on the Switch. Any comments, leave them in the comment section below. Subscribe and bye-bye.